What's going on there YouTube? I'm back once again. This is just going to be the voltage drop test on my fully mechanical box mod. Uh, there was a, I think it was Oso that posted. Uh, kind of curious what the voltage drop is. So here I am. I'm going to do one. And I'll watch a lot of videos on YouTube. Uh, as far as you know reviews on different devices uh, a lot of them state you know this has minimal voltage drop but they never really show you uh, I mean what's minimal uh, I don't know what that is uh, but that's why I'm gonna do it uh, this is probably not the most accurate way of doing it but this is the only way I know it uh, you know it's gonna be different this is not a standard it's gonna be different you know Depends on your batteries, depends on the atomizer you're using, whatever, whatever. But here it is, 8.26 volts. <clears throat> Have a uh, 0 0.39, 0 0.4 ohm build on my Plumeville. Dual coil, uh, 8 reps on a... 24 gauge 8 wraps on a 3 millimeter jewelry screwdriver. So, with that build, it's already kind of uh, kind on the upper limit as far as what these batteries can handle. But again, with the voltage drop, I should have enough room there, you know, uh, as far as the amp limit on my batteries. Because this is a 20 amp battery. battery so. So please, 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 please use Ohm's law. Uh, oh, use the use an Ohm's law calculator when building your atomizer, especially if you're using a series box mod. Uh, try not to build it too low. Uh, again, I should have enough room there where I'm not over taxing my batteries with a 0.4 build so here we go put my cover in this thing let me juice this up so 8.26 right how did I do this like this again this is pretty low build for a series so it should I would say about 1 1.1 volt Ooh, 7.3, 7.26, 7.4, 7.5, 7.6, 7.7, 7.8, 7.9, 7.10, 7.11, 7.12, 7.13, 7.14, 7.15, 7.16, 7.17, 7.18, 7.19, 7.20,